So now if we can if we go to a meta uh, meta mask icon and we click on the extension, you can see now I'm on the smart chain test. Now. Hello and welcome to today's video. In this video, I'll be teaching you how to add the Binance Smart Chain Testnet to MetaMask. So without further ado, let's get started. Actually, I have one thing to say. I'm sorry for not posting for the last two weeks. Um, I've been busy with school assessments because it's the end of the academic year, so there's a wave of assessments. So sorry for that. But anyways, let's continue. So the first thing you want to do is you want to open up your MetaMask wallet. So open it up, make sure it's unlocked. Then you want to click your profile picture. It's this thing, it might be different, but something like that uh, surrounded in the blue circle uh, at the top right. So you want to click that. Then you want to click settings, the most bottom option. Then you want to click networks, which is in between alerts and experimental. So click networks. Then you want to click add network, this blue button at the bottom. So once you once you have done that, it will open up a extension, a new extension tab. So we're going to hold on f to that for a minute, and we want to go to um, this page. So this page is is a official Binance article, and it will be the first link in the description. So make sure you go to the description and click the first link to go to here. Then you want to scroll down. Also, you can just check out the article for more information about uh, how to do it. But anyways, um, so you want to go down until you see testnet. So we're not doing this one, the main net. We're doing the testnet. So under testnet, so if we go back to the extension tab that MetaMask opened for us, we can see there's five values, notebook name, new RPC URL, chain ID, currency symbol, and block explore URL. So here there's also five values. So you just want to uh, copy it after the colon. So notebook name is smart chain testnet. I want to copy that and paste it here and so on and so forth. So I think you got the idea. So just do that for all of them. So once you've finished doing that, you want to click the blue save button. So just wait for uh, this loading thing to be gone. So it says connecting to Smart Chain Testnet. Just wait for that to finish. So it has been successfully added. You can see here it says Smart Chain Testnet was successfully added. So now if we can, if we go to our Meta uh, MetaMask icon and we click on the extension, you can see now I'm on the Smart Chain Testnet. So I, you can see I already have some existing BNB. I have 1.99008 uh, test BNB. This is not real BNB. So make sure you keep that in mind. This is not real BNB. This is testnet, and it's and it's worth nothing. And you can see it now. I can switch between different networks on MetaMask. So I can switch to the Ethereum mainnet, and I can switch back to the testnet. And from the testnet, uh, from this page, I mean, you can also um, you can send people test BNB. Like you can just put an address here, uh, and you can also receive by click uh, by clicking this copy to clipboard and copying your address, your BN your BNB testnet address, and you can send this to people to give you test BNB, or you can just go to a faucet. So use this for whatever purpose. So whether that is um, deploying a a test smart contract on on BSC or or whatever. So yeah so that's how you do it so if this video tells you something new and or you learn something new please like and subscribe also check out my ethereum nft collection called crypto tigers the website is crypto tigers club and the link will also be in the description check out the website for much more information such as what the nft collection is and how i created it nft minting is also available have a good day goodbye